Okay, sorry. Part two. I hit the button. It stopped it, so I got to start it back. There's the Martha Stewart punches on there. And these are EK Success or Stampin' Up. All the other punches. Bling. So I have all my bling in there. And I think there's two bins of it. Um, close to my heart stuff. There's all my close to my heart stamps and inks and stuff like that. Um, um, April, you'll remember this. This is Dave. Remember Dave from Ikea? The Dave table? Um, Bishop had it in his room. And so I put tissue paper on it and my podged it. Except it's stuck. Anyway. Let's see. This is all kinds of like random stuff too. It's just random. Chipboard minis and chipboard and stuff like that's in there. And then this is all cards. Like I've made and envelopes and stuff like that. And then I have um, my two Ikea cards. So this one is, um, I, I don't know. <laughs> There's Vanna. Um, uh -oh. I do Camp Reset. Corey, the Reset Girl, Camp Reset. So this is my Camp Reset where I keep all my stuff for that. That one, I had my Christmas projects in. But, um, well, Christmas is done now, and I don't have anything in it yet, again. Um, oops, that's about to fall out. And that's all there. Okay. Now, this is the wall that divides me and Charlie's room. And it's my Calyx, or Expedite, Expedite, ex whatever. Ikea. It's Ikea. And <laughs> this is Charlie's hospital something. <clears throat> so I like, really like Prima. So all my Prima stuff I keep in here for the most part. I don't know why. It's just, I like it by itself. I don't know. And then here is all my Project Life cards and sorted by theme or brand. And this used to be full. This looks good. This looks really good. So there's my punch. And there's more and more and more. Here is like Project Life kits. Like maybe our um, Studio Calico. Um, the Project Life that Stampin' Up! used to have. This is crepe paper. And this is like to make those flowers like that forget her name. Liz something, something, something. I don't remember her name. Maybe I'll think of it before. Anyways, I watched her at Creativation. I didn't go there. I watched the YouTube videos of her at Creativation. And, um, <laughs> someone has put these stars up here. And, uh, she made these beautiful flowers. And so, I was like, I want to try that. Well, I gathered all the supplies. And they're still right here. Here is all my kits. Like, my Close to My Heart kits and Kiwi Lane kits. That are, I mean, they don't have pictures and stuff with them. They're just like the kit as you get them. And here's Charlie. <laughs> Again. Okay, I got to show the next one. Okay, and down here. I keep moving this around totem pole guy um these are kits more kits like hip kit maybe click kit click kits click kits is that what that was called studio calico things like that the cute ones <laughs> um that's not project kits really this is all of my um page protectors like for project life that kind of thing. Oops, I had to make shift this little thing to make it work. Because they were too heavy. Alright, I know up here. Up here, though, I just have, I don't know, just things of main. There's some old Stampin' Up! stamps. I don't really use those. Um, 
But they look pretty in the jars, right? Sitting up there. And then there's just knickknacks up there. These are all empty albums. Empty, empty. These are all empty. This is... <laughs> it's water that Charlie used to paint with, and it was our water after we were done. I have stamps. These are where I keep all my wooden stamps. These are the tops to those. <laughs> but they're really good to hold your stamps and things that are flat. So see how they just nicely and you feel like you're five and try to make a long right in there. There's some more. So just keep those in there. My solid color paper packs. Um, like if I go to a crop, I can just grab one of those. These are like paper pads. Um, I don't use so much, but I went through them and I got rid of like 20 of them last year. Okay, so here's more thickers. Oh, and let's get this done. So stamp sponges and stuff like that. All my embossing stuff. All my foil papers and stuff. And I just, I run these through my laminator. I don't have a full machine. Um, hot light, light bulbs. So I'm just going to sell Okay, thickers. And then wood mounted stamp and my Stampin' Up wheels. Um, that's Charlie's school stuff. Oh, I think I missed those too. Anyway, this is, um, Disney. I'm still working on my Disney trip. I think I'll be doing that till the day I die. These are just eight and a half by 11 card stock. And it's a lot. Um, labels, my label maker and my photo paper. That's a little there. I usually keep my selfie in there, but. Um, my diamond 5D paintings in there. I have like the remnants of all the other kits. Um, and that's just papers, nothing major. And that's a random one with cords and stuff like that. And I think I skipped some of these. Um, here's all my leather making stuff and standing block. Trimmer, punch boards. This is Bella and Bishop's school box. And just my 12 by 12 paper. Pattern paper. That like when you bought them by themselves. These are card kits. And like the paper pumpkin and card kits. This is all of that. Um, page protectors. And these are more card kits. I have them in those bags. And this is just empty containers. My silhouette, my skin cut, all my mats, and vinyl. All of that down in there. And stencils. These are all my stencils. This is just... It was a planner drawer, but it's kind of got my candles from the other space. My daughter wanted her own room. That's the reason I've changed all again. And that's just more planner stuff. Um, and here's my dainty little wall over here. I love this little space. Um, it's just got like rhinestones. Rhinestones. That's a candle warmer. It's not on there. I don't think there's anything in there. There's a card that Riley made for me. Hi, Riley, if you're watching. Um, so I have these sorted by colors. So like this is my red ribbon embellishment. There's white and off-white. Looks like that one's green. That's Baker's twine back there. And all of my gold bits. And it looks like some pearls. And that's just like, I think, oops, random chipboard pieces. My grandmother made that 100 years ago. And these have embossing powder in them. Or they did. 
I don't know if they still do. Um, just some random, there's purple. Um, in here, I found, or these are just like vintage trims and stuff like that. And then this one is all my sequins. And these are napkins because I was like doing um, decoupage. You know, you can cover a box or whatever. Um, red beads. Silver. There's some. Here's some of the other ones that I did with the that, that one. That's got white and clear in there. Um. But this is from the air dry clay. You just stick in the molds and let it dry and then peel it out. It's kind of fun. Kind of therapeutic. And this is my little hippo. He's supposed to like have scents or like air aroma therapy kind of stuff in there. It's got lavender or something. There's white back there, it looks like. Um, and then I have it's hard to get down here black and blue and looks like more gold there there's brown back there and this is all one piece and that's what it is anyway so here over here is kind of my storage space oh wait i didn't show all this did i these are like charms and stuff and down there is more sequins and those are some kind of metal stencils i don't know i got this at hobby lobby too um, on like a super clearance, like I think I paid 20 or 30 bucks for it, but I thought it was so cute, and I just added my own lights up in there. They look blue on the camera, but they're really clear. So, my pearls I think there's blue beads in there. There's um, little stone things if you're doing like mixed media and stuff like that, this is just fun. Silver beads. I love Jack Skellington, so he's kind of randomly placed. Pearls in my old little vintage lamp I got at the Hope Center up here where I live. Um, random little tidbits. That's kind of like, um, you know, like older gold tarnished kind of look. And those look like tiddly links. I'm not sure what those are. Um... So, over here, that's kind of like where my bag stays until I go to a crop. And this is a washi holder, but I haven't put any washi in it yet. And there's like some more of those themed. So, Christmas, December daily, girly stuff and boyish stuff. Um, Halloween. And those are her beads. Don't tell her they're there. She makes a mess. Um, more four by six cards and my little six by six paper pads. And this is over here. This is Charlie's corner. Let me stand back and let you see. Because Bella, she's my mus musical artist. Charlie is my, she likes to play in the paper and the glitter and the glue and stuff like, like I do. So she's got a little desk in here behind mine and we can kind of see each other from our spots. So, she has, like, mostly my hand-me-downs, but, like, patterns, um, scissors, there's all her stamps, and it looks like she made a mess after I cleaned this up, but that's okay. Here's her poster. She's, she made this, or I helped her make it. Her note, finger is not up her nose, even though it looks like it, but she was in the bathtub, peeping out of the bubbles, and I had stamped a picture. So, she has her color pencils, her regular pencils. And then her, like, twistable crayons. All of her papers. It's construction paper. Um, although she does have a tub down below with 12 by 12 paper that I've given her. Crayons. One of those is her stickers. One of those is just random stuff to make her make stuff with. And there I have some more beads. And looks like there's my printer cords and stuff like that. And that's her little embalser. I had gotten that at a scrapbook and yard sale. And so, but she's she's not really much into using it. This was a dye I got, and she could eat her <laughs> her weight in bacon. She loves bacon, so she put that sticker on this 
sun and put it over her light. She says, it looks like the sun is just shining with bacon. And this is just one of those, I broke the thing. So this is a shade upside down <laughs> because uh, I broke, it had fallen over and broke. And anyway, that's my makeshift thing. And it doesn't get hot, so I made sure. Um, and there's her tub underneath of all her other extra stuff. And because she's messy, um, this is bathroom rug. <laughs> and this is kind of a bathroom rug, and it won't slide in her chair because she tends to get messy. All right, I think I am done. I know that was a lot, and if you're still here, thanks. Um, I could show some of the things on my walls. My mother-in-law actually did that for me, too. And I think that's that poor stuff um, that just came from Grand Turk. And I colored that picture there. It's my favorite picture. You can't really see it, but... And I framed it because it's my favorite picture. I colored. Um, I mopaged this paper on these... Um, on that TV tray because I liked it and I did it on this table as well. Um, I think that's it. If you got any questions, um, you can leave a comment below. I'll try to remember to answer and come back. I know I'm not a great YouTuber, but I seem to have a lot of people out there that maybe you want me to. Oh, and the reason, I guess I should say, I have these two chairs. These are two chairs, but I had gotten one for Charlie's side and one for my side, but you see her desk is smaller than mine or lower, and so it wasn't the right fit. So, I just put it over here beside mine and I put a blanket over it because I have such a long space that I scoop back and forth to do my work. So, yeah, it works out. All right, that's it. I hope you'll have a good day. See you later.